Good morning to our reverend, respected sisters, esteemed teachers, and my dear auxiliaries. Today, as we have gathered here to celebrate the 76th year of India's hard-earned independence, our hearts swell with pride and gratitude for the sacrifices of our great freedom fighters and their relentless pursuit of freedom that shaped our nation's destiny. On this auspicious occasion of the 76th year of freedom, let us take a moment to reflect on the remarkable journey that led us from the shackles of colonial rule to the vibrant tapestry that we proudly display today. Our history is replete with tales of valor and determination, where our freedom fighters stood tall against adversity, lighten the torch of liberty in the darkest of times. The countless unnamed heroes who faced the battles, endured imprisonment, and marched tirelessly for the sake of an independent India must not be forgotten. Their blood, sweat, and tears have enriched the soil on which our democracy stands today. As we stand at the threshold of another year of independence, we must remember that freedom is not merely a date on the calendar, but a relentless pursuit that requires us to safeguard the principles of justice, equality, and fraternity. Let us strive to make India a land where every individual is empowered to pursue his dreams, where opportunities abound, and where the spirit of unity prevails over division. May we stand united in our commitment to creating a better India, a nation that thrives on the values of compassion, tolerance, and progress. And the head is held high, where knowledge is free, where the world has not been broken up into fragments by narrow domestic walls, where words come out from the depth of truth, where tireless striving stretches its arms towards perfection, where the clear stream of reason has not lost its way into the dreary desert sand of dead habit, where the mind is led forward by being into ever-widening thought and action, into that heaven of freedom, my father, let my country awake.
হবে রাত্রি নিশীতে যাত্রীরা হুঁশিয়ার কাণ্ডারে দব সম্মুখে ওই পলাশির প্রান্ত বাঙালির খুনে লাল হলো যেথা ক্লাইভের খঞ্জর ওই গঙ্গায় ডুবিয়াছে হায় ভারতের দিবাকর দিবেশে রবি আমাদের খুনে রাঙিয়া পুনর্বার Class 9A students were presenting to us about the independent state. Do you feel anything within you? What do you feel? Who says the country? Don't say us, mine. Who says the country? And it's whose responsibility to keep alive the freedom that we have inherited. We got it from our leaders who have sacrificed themselves. They got it for each of us. We are free today. It just because of the you see some of them, they are put up here. And whose responsibility to keep alive this freedom? Mine. Really, mine. And you are the future of tomorrow, dear students. Each of you all those who are standing here. You are the future of tomorrow. It is in your hand to keep alive the freedom that we have got it from our leaders. It's very to have some programs to make our places colorful, yes, that's very easy. But to keep it within us, it's my country. I keep alive all that I have inherited in my country. So, dear students, let's speak to ourselves. To me and to all of us present here, particularly to you, the future of tomorrow. Take it, this is my country. I love my country. I will show it a action. It's very easy to feel. Feeling comes, feeling goes. No. But I keep it within myself. It's my country. I'm going to do all that I can to keep alive and show this is my country. Shall we?